On September 11, I was inside the World Trade Center when the first plane crashed into the North Tower. The hotel collapsed and the towers fell on top of it and the building was completely destroyed. There was so much debris raining out the window. There was metal, there was glass. There was just so much things falling from the sky. So I went outside and outside, the first person I noticed was a police officer. And he was yelling something. He was yelling something over and over again. He said, get out of this area and don't look up. He said, get out of this area and don't look up. And when you hear that, what do most people do? So I looked up. And when I looked up, I saw the North Tower in flames. And I saw the people jumping. I saw human bodies falling from the North Tower. And it was incredibly sad and shocking. It's an image you don't forget really easily. Uh, outside, just a few steps uh, down this path, there's a beautiful memorial. There's also a bronze memorial plaque facing the gazebo. It reads as follows, dedicated to the memory of the Framingham victims of September 11, 2001, and the thousands of victims and heroes of that day. You will always be remembered. For us, forgetting was never an option. Remembering is a noble and necessary act. How well you understand that. For that is exactly why all of you are here. We are witnesses to what happened on September 11, 2001. And we are witnesses to the lives of the 17 sons and daughters from Framingham, Massachusetts, who lost their lives that day. Let us continue to tell the story. You can only have peace when you forgive and move on and move forward. So forgiveness gives you a second chance and a new beginning. So with this tree, it will be a, it will be a symbol of a new beginning and hope for the city of Framingham. Thank you. Mm -hmm.